All right, let's see. Okay, so I'll do this Andrew question, but really this is the last question. Just came from vacation in DR. DR is Dominican Republic. And was wondering what you thought of economics in the Caribbean overall in terms of poverty, rights, individual in rights, investing, etc. Was thinking about retiring there someday. I mean, if you're an American, Andrew, then the place to retire is Puerto Rico because in Puerto Rico you have property rights and individual rights to the extent that the federal government enforces them. And you don't pay federal taxes. And uh, you can, if you structure your retirement right, you, you don't pay many taxes at all. So there are massive advantages to, to Puerto Rico over, if you're an American citizen, over a place like the Dominican Republic. I think the problem with the Dominican Republic and the problem with the rest of the Caribbean, well, with some exceptions like the Cayman Islands maybe, and maybe the British Virgin Islands, is that there is no respect for property rights and individual rights. And, and you could have a flip in the regime or something would happen and they, and they decide to to rob you of everything that you have, and there's no protection against that. That's why I like being in Puerto Rico, where I'm still protected somewhat by the rule of law, the American rule of law. Um, I don't think you get that. Now, Cayman Islands, the, the islands that have a more British tradition have more of a rule of law tradition, and therefore I would feel more comfortable in uh, if you don't want to come to Puerto Rico. Poverty is bad in all the Caribbean. Uh, again, Port uh, Cayman Islands might be an exception. Um, and, and poverty is a problem in Puerto Rico, and it's one of uh, one of the main issues here. Don't.